All right, good morning. <clears throat> it is October 10th, 2010. Yeah, pretty sure it's the 10th. I'm on my way to work. Don't mind like the random sun flares behind me. I'm an assistant coach for a swim team. Work is fun. But the bad thing about work sometimes is that you want to do so many things. You want to do so, so many things, and then you're like, oh, well, I have to go to work. So you want to make sure that when you go to work, it's doing something that you like. I see this as a job. I don't see this as my permanent career. As a career, my goal is to become a physical therapist. And as a backup, I'm going to be having a bachelor's of science in physical education and health. If you're going to be going to school, Go to school for something you like. Because if not, you're just throwing the money away. And, I mean, that's the worst thing you could ever do, right? Survival guide to being an adult, right? Just YOLO it. Nah, I'm kidding. Don't do that. That's a really bad idea. Today's plan. Go to work. Go home. Edit. And then get ready for a wedding. The pros of work, obviously, you get money. Everyone wants that little cha -ching. You can't, You can't live life without it. If you are living life without it, lucky you. We work for money, really. That's, that's a really big pro. Another big pro is, oh God, here it comes. Ah! <laughs> the sun. All right. your energy okay I'm done playing with the sun we also make connections uh, because let's be honest if you don't know the right people when you're going for a job you're basically screwed life's about making friends in the right places that's why you go to college for the most part you have to uh, network because those are the same people who are gonna help you get a job and the cons of working basically uh, if you had a social life uh, depending on your job, but for most jobs, this is true, uh, your so social life no longer exists. When I worked uh, at a retail, um, that that sucked. I'm not going to lie. But helping the people that are there, helping the people, uh, you know, put like the clothes away, put the stuff away, and making their lives much less difficult um, was great. And, and yeah, the customers were fun too because you got some customers that were actually really nice. Um, customers that actually, you know, cared about you having good customer service. Oh my God, the sun. You know, so, so yeah. But, oh, okay. Uh, now that we're here, let's, uh, let's cross the street here. So this is beautiful, beautiful concrete I want to do. Okay. That moment when you're recording and you forget to press the record button. So the past like three minutes you've been explaining of Kong 3 have gone to waste. So that's the break. Let me show you the Kong. It's right here. So ideally you would like to Kong and then pre and all that beautiful foliage is what you want to avoid. So obviously you'd be coming from over here. It'd be kind of difficult because of this entire thing and going to there, but uh, it's doable. And as I'm about to show you right now, you can see uh, how high this actually is. It's not that high, uh, so it's not difficult. But as I'm gonna show you right now, it's pretty close to my hips. But that's the goal. There's also kind of a running creep in here. Uh, obviously, you'd have to watch traffic come running, come off of here, land, and have the beautiful, beautiful background. There's that pre again. Alright, guys, so 
ready to go to this wedding and rocking the ponytail look and that's about it all right so we're here at the uh, reception as you can see everyone's mingling that's all the family over there and stuff like that so it's uh, the cocktail hour and uh, yeah it's a pretty nice place so can't wait to eat first off definitely I'm hungry as hell and yeah I can't wait till the rest of the night to unfold
so that concludes the vlog I am really really tired and I have to wake up tomorrow early to wash clothes so uh, good night train safe if you're training you never know I'll see you guys in the next vlog